What's up everybody and welcome back to another Questcraft modding video. Today I'm going to show you some nice quality of life mods that will make your game more immersive, more cooler, and realistic. I hope you enjoy this video and if you do, watch to the end because I have a surprise for you. Alright, so the first mod we're starting off with is called Nif Spiders. Nif Spiders is a mod that makes the spiders look like that. They climb up on walls instead of going up like this. It makes them way more scarier and more realistic. Unfortunately, this is only has 1.19.2 support, no 1.20 support, but every other mod in this video, except the ones I announced that do not have 1.20 support, su support 1.20. And now we'll go into a cave to show off some land dynamic lights and some sound physics remaster. As you can hear, there's some echoing and you can hear some random noises going on. Those random noises are from the ambient sounds mod, which I really don't know how to showcase, you just hear it in the background. But no further ado, this is what land dynamic lights looks like. You hold a torch and it lights up around you. This is a really helpful mod if you're caving and you do not want to waste about 4,000 torches just lighting up torch. Cave, I mean. Okay, so auditory. This has only goes up to 1.19.3. So, no 1.20 support, unfortunately, but if you hear it closely, if I swing my sword... You can hear that there is a sword swinging sound. Next, we have our Presence Footsteps mod. As you can hear, walking on grass sounds different, and if you're hearing the crickets and the owls in the background, that's also part of the ambient sounds mod. So if I walk on this gold, you can hear it's different footstep. Course jerk. Different footsteps, what it sounds like on stone bricks, sand, through any type of crop, on wood, on any type of stone block. And in my opinion, the most disgusting out of the few is this warped nice crimson mycelium. Yeah, it sounds pretty weird. Okay, so our next mod that I half recommend is Immersive MC. I have a way more in-depth video with this mod, how to install it and all that good stuff up in the corner of the screen right now or in the description below. So we'll just show you the basic features of it. You can open the chest with your hand like that. Take the things out of the chest. There you go. And close it. And you can go on a crafting table and craft anything you want, as long as you know the recipe. And then hold your trigger and just swipe across and it'll pick it up for you. You can also open a door with your hand like you would in real life. And then close it. In furnaces, you can place a block in. But if you want to place your whole stack in, say if you have a stack cool and you don't have to do that 64 times, hold your trigger in and put it there. Then hold your trigger in, put it there. So when this finished cook, oops, when this finished cooks, when this finished cook, when this, when this meat finish, finishes cooking, it will appear right here and it'll be a steak. And the last but not least mod, see, is called HT's Tree Shop. This makes chopping trees way much more faster. You hit the bottom, make it smaller, 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 smaller. Until you mine the whole entire mass of the all the logs in the tree, because it isn't like a cheat or anything. It's not gonna use less durability on your axe. It's still gonna use the same. See, it falls down, and that will conclude our video. And if you want to learn how to make your quest world look so much better, then click the video on the screen right now. See ya.